Hey guys, welcome back to Everybody here today with a new video. Today we're checking out We the People, <laughs> the demo from the Next Vest demos. This one, <laughs> it's giving me a bad vibe right off the bat. This is giving me some like very beginning of game being made vibes, like asset kind of game. But we'll see, you know? It's a shooter. Oh, man. It's already got a weird thing when you turn your head. It, like, snaps. Do you see that? When I stop moving my mouse, it does a wiggle after. I don't like that. I don't know if I've ever seen that before. Um, I... This game looked cool from the pictures, but, uh... Immediately it's giving me a bad vibe, but we're gonna see. I don't know why that is, but Another survivor head up the hill. We got supplies and shelter on the side of our defenses Okay, we're heading up the hill It's like kind of blurry. I don't it looked really nice on the but everything is like blurry looking right now Anyways, we're going up the hill. Here we go um, It's like an FPS of some kind it had sort of like a Tarkov Daisy kind of look to it uh, we're zing to prone. Crawling under the barbed wire. Everything has this weird, like... P like, fucking effect on it. it like, non rent It's, like, not rendered. Uh, anyways. We're... It's also running, like, not great. Not, like, on my computer, but more like the game itself <laughs> is kind of struggling. Uh, we're mantling. Um, we're doing like a goddamn military boot camp uh, area. I've got stamina in the bottom left, but it's behind my it's behind my my face cam. But there's a stamina bar. It's Ian. Hey, hold up! Before you head to the farmhouse, head over to the mount course and get some range time in. Death ahead. Bring firearm. Mount course. Okay. We're gonna get some range time in. Already the way I control my character's like head and shit, I do not enjoy just like moving around. And the like visual weirdness is giving me a headache. Uh picking up an M4A1. It's now in my one slot. Uh-huh. ADS, shoot, reload, flip up magnifier. Don't have that. 45 degree offset mount, can't do that. Uh, Alt T mag check, kind of like Tarkov. High, ready, low. Uh, okay. So I can put my gun down like, like that, or up, or like way up. Uh, I can shoot when it's like that too. And then, oh, oh, what the hell? <laughs> what the hell is this? This is so early. Um, okay, we're putting a, we're putting a siphon suppressor, and, uh, oh my goodness. <laughs> this is like Tarkov, but you're trying to do it while you're, oh, good lord. Okay, well, like. This one has the best ergo, and then <laughs> we want to put a uh, vertical grip. My wrist is broken. My wrist is broken. We want to put a uh. <laughs> we want to put a, a regular barrel. <laughs> what the hell is like you can't get to anything. Uh, a lot of beautiful optic options. Oh, they got the Charlie 5. I love the... Tr oh, they got a Reap IR. This is like every just attachment from Tarkov. This thing looks really weird, though. It sounds supposed to be that huge. I can have none or magazine. I should probably have a magazine. We can have a nicer stock. This, uh... Yep. It's not just me that thinks this is extremely scuff, right? Okay, well, it's good enough. We made like a monster gun. Oh Jesus. That might be too much. 
This bitch is chugging along. It's not even like... It's not even like chugging along like the game is stuttering or anything. It just like feels sluggy. This is a really weird sight too. Okay, whatever. Good enough. Um... So strange. How do I get ammo? My gun is now having a stroke. What the hell is going on? Okay, my guy's having a stroke. Ammo can. Uh, ammo for rifle. This is, uh... This is something. I have to drag everything. I can't just, like, click it over. You can stack them up to 90. Okay, I can reload now. I don't know why my gun is doing this. I can shoot now. I don't have a full auto option. Okay, my gun is currently stroking out. We have a gun. This, of course, is an extremely early build, like an alpha build. Uh, I think this is too early to have a demo, though. This is, like, barely functional. Like, I mean, the things work, I guess. It's just, like, clearly very early and rough. Um, it said danger this way, right? So I don't know if you're fighting army guys, or is this a zombie game? I don't know. Is this is this a Tarkov type game? Is there scabs out here? Oh, there's leaning. That's interesting. The sight is also like red light when I'm looking through it. For there's a flashlight. There's a gas can. Sure, we'll take a gas can. Oh, there's this is like a, a looting game now? There's a power cable? An old hammer? Okay, we'll take an old hammer. I don't really know. I guess this is Tarkov. I don't know what's going on. I gotta check every locker. Like, is this a survival game? I, I'm sorry I don't know. I, I should probably look into these things, but I just like looked at the picture and was like, hey, looks pretty neat. Oh, it is a zombie game. I was looking at my goddamn chat. Okay. Alright. It is a zombie game. Or there was a homeless guy. Either way. <laughs> One or the other. I wish my gun would stop flickering. Oh. I still am not sure. Oh! Good Christ. There's like literally no audio. Fucking hell. I still don't know if these are homeless men or zombies. I'm gonna go with zombie. Why is everything so blurry? Everything's flickering. This game is like designed to just make you sick. Can I loot the computer? This is definitely Tarkov. Whoever made this has definitely played Tarkov. I can't even s Am I hurt? Oh, I'm hurt. My stomach's zeroed. This is Tarkov. Okay, that zombie zeroed my stomach. This is literally just Tarkov. If it was like a zombie survival uh, H1Z1 kind of game, which I guess is cool. Um, bottle of water, can of salmon, bottle of water, this adds hunger and thirst. Oh, we're drinking. You know, this is impressive in some senses, I will say, because, like, Tarkov is extremely impressive, just the fact that it, like, works. So, the fact that this, like, kind of is working... And, like, it's coming along. My sight is floating here now. The one... Because that's where I was when I started to drink the water. Um, drink another water. We might as well. So, I think we're bleeding, maybe? I think this is bleed, possibly. Because my, like, li all my limbs are being hurt. It looks like I'm bleeding from the... From the zombie. We've got a quest log... Your first quest is understand this is a technical demo, not a full game. True. I think I'm bleeding to death. So, if we don't find something for that, I think we'll be dead soon. They've got the coughing kind of thing from Dark Dog, which is cool. My eyes are blurry. I assume that's a two-level bleed, I think. Is there more to it than this, or is this the entire area? Because I'm like... This might be it. Everything's fenced in. <laughs> Was this the game? Oh, am I dying yet? 
Oh, I'm really hurting. I'm a real hurting guy. I mean, it reminds me of Tarkov, I guess. It's like the... They tried. If you've never played Tarkov, basically all of these effects, and even like the eating and drinking, and like the gun, everything about this is kind of trying to be Tarkov, but like with zombies, I guess. Uh, and like a survival game. This is not a real like interactable thing. Soldiers, help me! I'm ble I'm bleeding to death. Is this the whole demo? Is just this area? This is more of like a technical test than a than a demo. Sir, I'm going to die. I need medical attention. Holy shit! He's immortal. Why doesn't he fight the zombies if he's immortal? Uh, I think we're dead. Okay, we're just waiting for our thorax to run out, and then we should die. Oh, death. That was death. I'm still coughing. <laughs> Alright, this has been We the People, the alpha build. <laughs> One of the most embarrassing builds I've ever played of a game. Um, that's a look at We the People. Oh, there's zombies right on the goddamn thing. I'm just blind. Um, yeah. It has something. Like I said, clearly it's got promise. I just can't tell if they, like, actually have promise and they know what they're doing or if they just kind of had an asset bundle starter pack and, like, exactly ripped off Tarkov's sort of mechanics and functions. It like got it kind of working and then called that a demo. I don't really know. Um coming soon. Be surprised if it really like ever comes out, unless it's just like a scheme for money or asset flipping or something. But uh that is a game kind of. <laughs> I'll give it that. That was a look at We the People. Uh let me know what you thought down below if you enjoyed. Uh, it's like a Tarkov wannabe H1Z1 sort of vibe, which, you know, if it was done well, would be interesting, but they're a long ways off. Good luck to you guys, if you're legitimately going to make the game, good luck to you. Uh, yeah, no ill will or anything, I've just, I've seen it all on Steam, okay? Um, I I'm just a little bit, a <laughs> little bit hard to uh, believe, but that's about it. Thank you guys for watching. I appreciate it. I'll see you in the next one. Bye. That was We the People. Uh, that one was definitely a letdown. I, th I, th I thought we were going to find like the next goddamn Tarkov, but not so much. <laughs>